Today, we are going to Chipotle. It has been a little while since we've been to a Chipotle. I know that you can get like a burrito, which is very large, or a bowl. You used to be able to maybe like get a salad? Can we get a salad, salad maybe? I don't know. I don't remember. Or you just put a lot of lettuce in your bowl. <laughs> right. This one happens to be in Mount Dora. It's next to the Starbucks we've done, Peach Valley Cafe, the Chinese place, China Star, uh, Five Guys. So we're kind of finishing out this little area here. Um, didn't want anything that would take super long, but we're gonna go in, get us some food. I think I'll do the bowl. Not sure. I like the burrito. We'll see. A lot of times we share because mm -hmm. it's huge, but I think this time we'll just each get something and then get, I'm gonna get the chips and cheese too. Although, just a side note in the intro here, I am more of a Qdoba fan, and there's not a lot of Qdobas around here, mm -mm. but I am more of a Qdoba fan than Chipotle. So comment below which one you like the best, but for this video, doing Chipotle. Let's go check it out. Same process as other places like Five Guys and all that. You go in, you order at the counter, so it could get a little awkward just because people uh, people are there and like people are sitting outside too. Let's see if we can find the hours. It says, thank you, 10.45 a.m. to 11 p.m. daily. I'm guessing, can you do mobile order here? I'm guessing you can. Uh, I don't know. They've got rewards, but I'm guessing you can do mobile order. It seems like a lot of people are getting it to go today. Yeah, over there, look. Mobile order pickup on the wall, just around the corner, restrooms, drink station. Here's a look at the menu. Then you order up here, and as you order, you tell them what you want on your, like in your burrito or bowl. Sorry, the music's a little loud in here, but I'm gonna zoom in on the menu. So if you can see up there under entree, you can do burrito, bowl, tacos, or salad. And then you pick a protein. And then once you do that, you can add extra like the queso or guac. And then as you walk down up front here, you can add certain things on your, on your food. Like, I mean, they've got beans and other stuff. I will try to do my best filming it. We'll see how it goes. It can get a little awkward. Under drinks though, they have uh, margaritas here, seven dollars and fifty cents. I wonder if you can get those to go. I'd be curious to see. And then at the end, they've got chips and queso, chips and guac, chips and salsa. Um, they do have beer, bottled drinks, soda, and iced tea, as well as organic lemonade. Ooh, that sounds good. I'm gonna do a chicken bowl, and Timber's gonna do a chicken burrito. I'm definitely gonna add queso on mine. We'll see what other stuff we want as we walk down there. And I think I'll ask if we can do the margarita to go or not. Honestly, after reading this chicken al pastor, I think I'm gonna do that. It shows pineapple, lime juice. It's kind of spicy. Yeah, it's probably gonna be pretty spicy, but I think that would be good. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do the chicken al pastor bowl. You can see here, they've got their um, tortillas there, the grill going in the back, and then here's some toppings they got along the way. Look at how big these burritos are. They're massive compared to like just a normal size one. They are very, very large. What beans should I get? Do whatever ones you want. Black There's beans, probably. I like black beans. Um, chicken, There's the chicken al pastor, that looks very good. You can see all their meats. So here's my bowl, here's her wrap. Got white rice, black beans, chicken al pastor. She got white rice, black beans, and just regular chicken. And we'll work our way down here, I'm gonna get some queso too. Um, sour cream, cheese, and lettuce, please. That's all, thank you. Could I do queso, please? Uh, mild corn, sour cream, uh, cheese, and then just a little bit of lettuce, please. 
Thank you so much. We'll have to explain some things, but looks like they're maybe um, out of ice and they're out of some other things as well. Watermelon limeade? Look at these drinks. A little frustrating on uh, the things they're out of. We'll explain in the car. All right, heading outside with our big bag of queso. It's actually really nice out today and you can sit outdoors if you'd like. Just wanna share the sunset out and about today. I love seeing the palm trees with the sunset. All right, here's what the food looks like. There's the bowl. Mmm, that looks very good. <laughs> That's the small queso. There's the ginormous burrito with our, our chips from home. So we're gonna dig in. They don't, they didn't cut it, did they? Oh, that's right. No, they don't. We tried sharing one time and said we were on the road and we were like, can you cut it for us? And they said, no, we can't do that. You can't share. And we were like, but yet we can just buy one, go out in the car and just eat, take each take a bite. And they're like, yeah, we can't cut it for you. So that's right. But we do, we did get some of their, they actually have really nice like plastic spoon forks and nice. But this is what it looks like. Now I do really like their chips. They have good chips, but we have to do what we have to do tonight. So here's their queso with our chips. That's good queso. That's very good queso. It's almost worth it to like get a plate or something because you got to dig underneath to get the chicken. But I'm going to see if I can. Oh, there we go. Got some. There's the inside of the burrito. Did you get much? All right. I'm going to try this. What was it? Chicken al pastor. Chicken al pastor. That's good. Not, it wants to be spicy. Uh, it's a little, okay, it's a little spicy. Maybe like a hot sauce from Taco Bell. But it's nothing where I'm like, oh, give me a drink right away. But the flavor's amazing. It tastes really good. I think we're just going to work on eating some of our stuff now. And then afterwards, we can just do a recap. Did you finally get down to your chicken in there? Close. I mean, that's mm -hmm. huge. That is a huge burrito. Mm -hmm. It's good bang for your buck. I mean, 26 bucks, not bad. I'm not sure. Let me see how much the... Like $3.99 or something? $1.45 for that queso, oh, which isn't bad, really though. bad at all. No. That's not bad. No, I take it back. Queso on my stuff was $1.45, $2.65. Okay. For the little queso. Yeah. And they have a code. You can go online and ask, tell them how they're doing. And then if you, you can go online and also get their um, rewards program. I'm not really sure what that looks like. It does say if you want to work for them, you can get a free burrito or free Chipotle, debt-free college degrees, bonuses, rapid career growth, and more. So that's kind of cool too. I'm getting pretty full, so I might be taking this for lunch sometime. And then this is what the burrito looks like on the inside of it. You've gotten about halfway done on that as well. Mm -hmm. Still got quite a bit of cheese left, which is good. It's actually a pretty big bowl, even though it doesn't look very big. All right, that was our trip out to Chipotle. I'm stuffed, so this definitely makes I guess, yeah, a meal for you mine. and a meal for me. So four meals out of it is what we got. I mean, we're just going to probably finish off the cheese tonight. I mean, it was good. I really was hoping to try the margarita, though. Um, and I was bummed that they didn't have chips. But luckily, you were thinking ahead and were like, hey, we got chips. So let's get the cheese. I'm glad you did. Um, other than that, I mean, they're mostly all the same. So I would recommend going out and trying them. And then, like I mentioned before, comment below if you like Qdoba or Chipotle better. We'll have to do a, a Qdoba review sometime. Mm -hmm. Maybe we'll do that at Universal because I believe they have one at Universal. I think so. I don't think it's Chipotle. I think it's Qdoba. I think you're right. Yeah. But anyway, that does it for tonight. Thanks for watching.